Hi, I'm Rob Johnstone from Woodworkers Journal. And have you ever considered building one of these fold-up beds, like for your house or your cabin? Well, check this out. Murphy beds, which is what we call this type of fold-up bed, have been around for a long time, invented by a guy named Murphy, who invented it so he could entertain women in his apartment without having a bed in the room. What we do for love. Woodworkers Journal and Rockler have a long history of providing plans for differing styles of Murphy beds, with the variations mostly being the cabinets in addition to the sides of the actual beds. And most of our offerings thus far have been vertical queen-size beds, so this time we're doing something different, a horizontal twin. In my mind, this horizontal twin version of a Murphy bed is so practical. It fits nicely into a small spare room, handy at your cabin, and you could even put a television set above the bed. To demonstrate just how easy it is to build this kind of Murphy bed, we followed the instructions that came with the hardware step by step. It was very easy. So I've never actually installed a Murphy bed, but I know that it's critical to do it right. And so I've asked a friend of mine to come in. He's actually built and installed several Murphy beds. It's Dan Carey. Hey, Rob. Hey, Dan. So give me the straight scoop about installing a Murphy bed. Well, the most important thing is that this cabinet be securely attached to the walls. That means driving fasteners into the studs or framing behind the wall. So that's pretty self-evident, but, but lay it out for me. The reason we need to do that is because Murphy beds feature these pistons, and they're there to help you lift and close or open the Murphy bed without having to lift all of the weight. If this cabinet is not securely attached to the wall, then rather than have the bed lift and close, the cabinet could pull off the wall and fall. So that makes total sense. And I imagine it's even more important with a large vertical Murphy bed. That's right. The Murphy beds I've installed in the past have been vertical style, both queen and full size. And the taller the bed, that means when it opens, it's extending further out in the room, which means even greater force. So the manufacturer recommended using three inch lag bolts like this to secure it to the wall. Okay, I get it. Follow the directions to a T. Is there anything else I need to know? There is one more thing. The manufacturer does not recommend that you build Murphy beds out of MDF or particle board. The forces that are on these beds and pulling away from the wall are just too rigorous for materials like that. Use plywood to build your Murphy bed. Thanks, Dan. So I guess that about sums it up. I hope you've enjoyed today's video and maybe learned a thing or two. I'm Rob Johnstone from Woodworkers Journal. Thank you for watching.